Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Fun with Noah, Noah and Josie. Today we are doing a activity sort of craft item. So why don't yeah. you bring them out guys? Hey. Exploring oceans. Today we're going to be doing these think box activities where we're going to explore the ocean. And Mom, I'm back. Mommy, I want to open it. Okay, so we shall open it. Yep. Yes. Oh, we're going tight. to open it. Let's type. Open now. Yeah. I, I, I faced the worst. All right. But I can't open it. Look up. I got that now. All right. So. so. Mommy, I'm bad at opening Thank you. boxes. Thank you. All right, so let's go through what's in the actual box itself. All right. All right. So to start off, we've got what looks like stickers of some sort, I believe. Uh, a book. booklet, an ocean's manual. We have cartoon fishes and stuff. Ooh, it's got a bunch of different activities in there. And facts. And facts, probably. I'm good at this one. And then this looks like some kind of poster. Yeah. Now it also comes with, of course, the sand stuff. We got a little tray. Just think of it. And we've got our own trays here to make sure we don't make a big mess. And then, all right. this one has to clean up all of our messes. Then we also get, I should have brought the scissors out. I think I got them. Yeah, how about you? Noah's going to run and get the scissors. We forgot the scissors. Ow. Mama, I got a thing on my Yeah, hold on, baby. All right, so Joyce is extra excited about this. She loves stickers. Stickers. All right. I am back. With the scissors, okay. The scissors of destiny. The scissors are the only reason we're doing this. Yeah, I know, no one's but so much easier to open. <laughs> All right, here's Joyce's tray. I don't need scissors. All right, hold on now. Let me do. Ow, I need scissors. <laughs> now, it also comes with... Sand! Sand, yes, you're right. And... We make it wet. We don't. We actually. do not make it wet. Yeah, I was joking. A bunch of other little things inside that bag. All right, now it also comes with a smaller bag here that comes with... Sand. No, it looks like it comes with a collector's card, some dog, a microscope, or not a microscope, a magnifying glass. Use your brain. Yeah, a little uh, rake. Oh, that rake. Let me do the now. Yeah, I don't want your butt beside me. All right. Now I think we got all the pieces out of the baggies. Yeah, no, where'd your boards and everything go? Okay. I'm stashing them in my Noah stash. Noah is hiding them. Before you dive in, make sure to read all the instructions carefully. So there is instructions. That is a poster. Each activity comes with the English version and the French version, which is Fun. great for us Canadians. Okay, um, I believe it looks like there's 14 of these activities in total. We'll see how many we can actually do. Hopefully, our max one is probably going up to five. All right. Yeah. 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 Nah, ah, 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 ah. All right, we're gonna look at what is all in these boxes. And of course, normal salt. Uh, Let me see, come here. Come Nobody's here. favorite. Sit up on your pillow. 
I'm not getting that. What is this? All right. So first we're going to look through what are in these little baggies. Yeah. Because there's a lot to these kits. Yeah. The only downfall is it looks like you need a lot of different items. Extra items. So we're probably going to have to take a break so I can go grab different items. Okay. So here's our little measuring cups. Yep. They look just like the... Ah. They look just okay. like normal measuring cups. No, they look like the um, lab cups. No, little didn't... measuring cups you get with um, medicine. Medicine, that's it. All right, so we get the little measuring cups. You get a little brush. This is actually an okay brush. Bristles are really nice on it. All right, and then we also get, I believe these are the fact cards. They give you different little facts. All right. I'm a bird. We get the cute little magnifying glass. Mom? I'm a bird. All right, so Noah's a bird. All right, here's your magnifying glass. No. Okay. I'm in my hand. You need to wait, please. Okay, then we get a little spoon. And we get the collector card. Thanks so much. My book. You'll be sticky. That's my book. Mm-hmm. Oh, look at that. We'll be doing activity four today. Yay. Like, to start, we'll see what else we can do. No. For activity four, we will be needing our magnifying glass. Yeah. Uh, mine's not okay. open yet. I don't know how it's not open, but... Mommy, I'll be in my book. Okay, hold on, baby. So, we will be needing our magnifying glass, our yeah, yeah, lab yeah. tray, our measuring spoon, huh? and the Ooh. treasure bag. Thank you. Boop. All right, let's find where it opens, or else we're going to be making a big mess, right? Oh, that feels nice right there. I'm scratching my cat with this. That's a cat scratcher now. Yes. Once we're done with this craft thingy, this is going to be a cat scratcher for Puff. All right. So. Get that in. This is the treasure mix. Okay, so we're going to put it right here. <sighs> So do we have everything we need? We're gonna take a quick break. I'm gonna go grab the vinegar and we will be right back. And welcome back. We have got our vinegar. Now, very stinky. Right? Very stinky. Very stinky. First, we're going to be taking. All right, you ready? Yeah. We're gonna move the salt out of your way because. Salt. My souls. Remember, all you need is your treasure bag. All right. I, all right. Now, look for the spot that says A. A. Which one says A? This one. A. Well, not, this little one. Okay? A. Well, the old, I think the old one. Except the Z. Yeah. All right. So, the first step is we're going to be using our little yellow measuring spoon and we're going to be adding 10, ten. spoonfuls mm -hmm. of our sand I do it. put it in this one this one this one it's so good so okay. which one are we going in a all right we're going to be adding 10 of them here mommy scoop Mom, go. All right. uh, and then two two Mama, do it. Yep. And I three. Have three. I still have one. And now I have two. Four. <laughs> Shouldn't we just dump it in? Five. Nope. Five. You gonna do it? Six. I do that I don't. Seven. Know. I think I'm ah, at six. You're gonna break the spoon. Eight. 
Seven. You do nine, it. Nine. Six. Ten. What's the six? I meant eight. Nine. Okay. Just in case I'm going to do eleven. So the cute thing about these books is as it's telling you the instructions, it's also giving you little think about this facts. I do it in Okay, no more. We have ten. Okay, I got ten. So let's read our think about this fact. Noah, would you like to read it? Yes. Uh, sand forms when rocks break down over time by wind, rain, and other weather conditions. There are a ton, wait, there are tons of colored sands in nature, like white, black, even pink, depending the type of rocks that are in the area. Whoa. Most sand contains silicon dioxide, a naturally occurring compound of Found in quartz. The white sand Hi. on tropical islands is made of coxelum carbonite, which comes from shells and parts of coral reefs. Hmm. All right. Now, there's a bunch of colors. All right, so it says we need to take a closer look at our sand. I do it. The sand. And you're gonna look at it. I'm looking. And you're gonna record your observations. We're not actually going to record, we're just gonna talk about it. I see bad it's spelling. Pink. I think. Did you see pink? Yeah. Yeah, there's a bunch of this pink and black I and some gray. In oh, there. I've been always a little bit of a little bit of a Um I see sand. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Another thing about this. Did you know that glass is made from liquefied sand? What? Sand <laughs> with lots of silicone dioxide liquefies when it's heated to a very high temperature. <laughs> Minecraft. <laughs> All right. Next step, we're going to be filling these things, I'm guessing. Put some in there. Nope. We're going to be filling a big one. bowl B of your tray lab. Oh, a pink one. Yeah, hold on. We're going to be filling bowl B mm. of the tray lab quarter of the way with some more sand using your measuring spoon. Okay, so. So I just dump? No. Oh, Follow I instructions. We are. Not dumping. We are spooning it in until it's about a quarter of the way. How do you do it outside? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Now I'm just gonna empty the one beside it. Mama, it's just it. perfect level from A. I get it. Oh, perfect. See, mommy can do it a little easier. Mm -hmm. That's gonna take a while. Okay, hold on. I think that's about a quarter. Hmm. All right. I'm guessing we're gonna have to fill C with. I don't know. Noah likes to make big messes when he uh, experiments. Yeah, that's the point of experimenting. Get messy. Ex messy experiments, okay. Now, we're going to be using our measuring cup to add vinegar to bowl B until it's three quarters away full. Hold on. Three quarters. No, it's just saying we're going to be pouring vinegar into all right we're gonna be filling mine up fill my up all right hopefully that no maybe a little more yep okay. that's it good so fill we're gonna be, up. hold on we're gonna be taking this and filling up our b which is the middle one here and yes. we're gonna be filling it all fill the way mine. to about three quarters of the way full Ah, uh, you went all the way up. That's not three quarters. Too light. Okay, so Noah went too far up in his, but we will see what we can do with Joyce's. Okay. I'm gonna do it with you. All right, we're gonna fill. Hold on, hold on. There. Okay. So three quarters of the way up. Then what happens when you add 
Do you see bubbles? Yep. I don't. Do we not see bubbles? Nope. I don't. There's no bubbles. Stir it. Let's see if we stir it. Mom, I do it. I'm starting to see some weird things, but I'm... So we are mixing, and we are not seeing bubbles. Bubbles. Even I am. Oh, is... you missed it. Bubbles disappeared. They pop. Okay, stop holding on. Wait, what if I do this? All right, oh, so. Bubbles. Oh, wait. No. no, no bubbles. Yeah, bubbles. Think about this. When an acid like vinegar and a base like the calcium carbonate in the sand mix, carbon dioxide forms, which creates bubbles. Yeah. Come on. I, I got some vinegar from here and poured it in here, took some from here, dumped it in, bubbles. You just gotta keep mixing till it's soaked. Then you're gonna start seeing some bubbles. Mm -hmm. Then mix in a dry area, which in A, you should. So, and then mix, 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 pick it up, pour it in, bubbles form. There, bubbles. Mom. So, Nola is right. I mean, if you just add the sand to the bubbles. Mom, I do it. Or, if you add the sand to the vinegar, you'll see yeah, the bubbles. I'm smart. Welcome back. We have gotten rid of the experimental trays and the kids have decided they want to just play with this messy, messy sand. Sand. Joyce is... What me, are you doing? Me and Joyce are builders. What, what are you doing, doing here? Builders! You're building? Alright. So we've got... Starfish. We got this shell. I don't know what it's called. I'm pretty sure it's called a cone shell. Cones. It looks like an ice cream cone with a bit, a tiny bit of ice cream on top. Yeah, that's probably why it's called a cone shell. Hmm. Well, this looks I like think a, it's cone. a cone. A literal. This right here is the cone for the ice cream cone. And this is the little bit of ice cream that's left. <laughs> but there's still. As you can see, hopefully. So, Joycey has made... A cream cone. Ice cream cone. It's a lot of it. Joycey knocked over her ice cream cone. Okay. As you can see, there's a little bit of ice cream right. left in this ice cream cone. There's... Okay. No! Alright, Joycey's going to keep playing with sand. Me too, ish. Noah and I are going to move on to another experiment. Yes, in a second. In a second. Okay, Noah wants to build a tower with his sand first. So we're going to be moving on to the salt activity. So, like we've already mentioned before, the kit comes with three different salts. You've got your sea salt. Normal salt. Your everyday table salt. And, um... And your... Rock salt. Rock salt, which is also known as... Sea salt. Ish. Well, technically, every salt is sea salt. It's another type of salt, which apparently I can't remember the name of. Yeah. So, this activity requires Mama. the salt, this look, 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 activity please. card, and tape. It doesn't say what type of tape, so I just grabbed your everyday normal, transparent tape. What I've done is I just added the tape on the card give it some place for the salt to get all stuck to it says we need to start 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 with the sea salt we're gonna take the sea salt cut 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 we need one of the spoons spoon are all the spoons there's one Early okay dinner. i need one we're going to add some of the sea salt to the spoon to make it easier to put it on the card. Okay. So then we're going to add to the spot that says sea salt. There's that. Attachies! Right. 
right, we're gonna add it on to the it's tape. crystal -y. I already found that out. Pretty crystal. Let's see if we can. Oh, it fell off. It all fell. <laughs> okay, so this tape is not the greatest for things to stick to. Just like fastest tape falling off, maybe. Mm. It's a safety tape. The salt or the salt just doesn't want to stay on it. All right, we're gonna just make Hi. a big mess. Hi. Right. No, I'm short. I don't want to tilt it too much, but mm -hmm. you pretty much you tape the salt to the, the card thingy. So let's add the rock salt. Rock, rock and roll. And this uh, one has no hole. Uh, I haven't played yet. Uh, keep keep this stuff away from your eyes. Yes. Okay, this is <laughs> the salt does not want to stick. Are you making a big mess? Mm. Yeah. You just showed my tower. Yeah, she did. Me. The All right. Switching then. Salt. Table salt. I want to eat it. All right. So this stuff is not sticking to the card. Yeah. Yeah. I just ate it. All right. So when you look at the different types of salts, this one's crystally, this one's red, this one's salt. You can tell that they yeah. are all different sizes. Yeah. All our everyday salt is tiny, tiny, tiny crystals, and then our sea salt is just medium, just a little bit, and the rock salt is big. Yes, big. Big. All right, so think about this. All salt comes from oceans or seas, depending on how and where Rivers. where salt is collected, determines whether it will be sea salt, rock salt, or table salt. Sea salt forms when seawater dries out. Did you know that? No. I'm totally not eating it. Do not eat salt on its own. It is not healthy for you. Yep. Um, Mommy food. I want food. Joyce wants food. Rock salt comes from salt mines, where Ooh. salt deposits are found in layers of the earth that were once uh. part of the sea or an ocean. Because of climate change and stuff. Yeah. The earth is constantly changing. Because of evolution. Yeah, I'm evolution smart. and climate change. Climate change. <coughs> Why else would the Earth be changing? Uh, science. The environment uh, always changes. So, for example, right here where we are sitting, could have been a jungle, could have been an ocean, could have been a grassland. Yeah, could have been any one of those. The climate right. change had to just. Smack it out and just yeah. And then our final salt here, table salt. Yummy. It comes from mines, but is processed to remove other minerals and often has iodine added to it. We are now gonna move on to activity eleven, where we will be using stickers again. In this activity, we're going to be placing where they go on yeah. their thing. Whoa. Okay, they come off individually. All right, so we have, we're going to be using this for our stickers. And putting them underneath the actual name, probably. Where they go. Yep. Oh, no, we'll put them beside. No, that's not. I'll sleep in two super glass. Okay. Now well, these stickers are the type of cling on stickers, so they cling on to things that are cold, smooth, like windows. Cold. Walls. Mm, yeah, maybe walls. If, if you the, iron them. If the walls are smooth enough. If you iron them. Iron what? The walls. Iron the walls. 
<laughs> and if you have noticed, Joyce has kind of disappeared on us for a moment. Disappeared. All right. Ghosty. So we have the different zones. We've got our sunlight. Our sunlight zone. Our I don't remember what's called. Our, so. <laughs> our twilight zone. Our midnight zone. Uh, our abyss. abyss and the trenches. They all have their scientific names as well. In case you want to be a science. Alright, so first. Bill Nye the science guy. First, we got a cute little fish. Fishy. I want to stick with the fishies. And where would the fishy go? Probably here and there. The fishy will go in, right the, in the middle. The sunlight zone. But most commonly in the sunlight, rarely in the twilight. Alright. Now, we also have a dolphin. A dolphin? A dolphin goes... No, sunlight. sunlight zone. We have the swordfish now. So Which is twilight. Twilight? Yeah. So down maybe middle. maybe it's like between twilight and yeah, it's like sunlight. Yeah, it's in the middle. So it's kind of in that area. All right, now we have the angler fish. Where do you think the angler fish is? Oh, I know where it is. Oh. Let me see. Where's this? this you guy? see this creepy little fishy? Angler fish goes we in. We 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 in between. I think it goes in the middle. So. Or right in here. Kind of areas. Well, it's more down here. But I'm here. guessing the angler fish ah! There. Alright. Now Stop. we've got wicky, wicky, wicky. the octopus. Ah, uh, midnight. Yeah. Maybe the twilight. Maybe over here somewhere. Alright. Now we got our giant squid. I think Squiddy. he goes in the abyss. That's yeah, almost. That's where sperm whales and fossil squids sometimes fight. Yeah. And then we got a bunch of different starfishes. Starfishes. Fishies. Uh, what do you think? Well, I we won't see any. And the sunlight. The starfish. We are thinking they go all in the twilight Those zone. Those are different starfishes. What do you mean? They all look the same. Why is there multiple? I don't know. Maybe to give them more coloring. Color. Or more. maybe they're in each. They're in every area, technically. You think they're in everywhere? Yeah. They're okay. everywhere. So just put them around. Decoration. All right. Now we got these nice green looking Joyce plants. Now we got these nice green looking plants. What? We're gonna put them in the twilight zone. All right, and now we have shrimp. Where shrimp. do you think shrimp should go? Right with the swordfish. The swordfish, right around here. Yeah. Okay. Just a break to glare. Uh, yeah. turtle. I'm guessing sunlight. Ah, slash midnight. A real thing. Sunlight. Why? Why? No, sunlight. <laughs> turtle doesn't want to stay though. He's like, nope, nope. And then these funny looking. What are these? I can't remember their name, but I know where they go. Where do they go? They go at. They go way about here. You think they go in no, the abyss? No, I know, I know. Alright, so no one knows. These funny looking plant sticks go in the abyss. They sort of look like weeds. Alright. Underwater weeds. So this is our guess Bill! of this. Activity. Some we know. Well, some we know, some are kind of a guess. Uh, Twelve is more stickers where we will be working to make a food chain. All right, so out of now, animals that are see if our guesses were right. This is also another cling on goat. A food chain is pretty much. We're on the top of the food chain. We are one of the top on the food chain. So the food chain. Explains what? Uh, what animals eat what? And yeah. Yeah. And what Pretty much.
Hopefully. Stays at the bottom of the food chain. Oh, fine, I got this thing off. This is so tight. Noah is becoming obsessed with tape. Alright, so they come with these large stickers here. We're just gonna. Well, actually. Well, that's how you know what. We threw our large stickers to connect from our food chain here. This and this is what we came up with. No, come off. It's in there. Yeah. Also comes with extra stickers where you can just pretty much put them wherever you'd like. With these cute little fact cards, pretty much. They are these uh, cards that have pictures, and then there's the cards that have the facts. You can make a game up with them and try to guess which facts go with which. Yeah, baby, oh. the now, yes, the kit also came with a very large poster. As you can see. Um, <laughs> For today, opening the Think Box oh, Ocean Explorer. I jinxed you. Uh, Explorer Ocean Dingy Mabobber. Yeah. It, um, it's okay. It was kind of fun. I mean, it's more of a learning thing, thing than um, playing. playing around with. We would like to say thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. You say, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. She's going nuts. Yeah. Joyce has been sitting for too long. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a fantastic day. Yes, don't forget to like and subscribe. We will see you later. See you later. Where are they gone? Show. Ice cream shop.